All right, folks. Here's a 2013 Chevy Suburban with a check engine light on on the dash. All right, hooked up the scanner. See what we got. We have a number one cylinder misfire. Okay, that's what it says. The other one is a permanent code. All right, so I detect a little bit of a shake. Let me just show you on the car. If you look at the engine, let's place it right here on the fender. I don't know if you can see it. I'm trying to see how you can compare it. And it has a little bit of a shake to it. Maybe from the front. See, it has like a little bit of a, a shake to it. All right, so the number one cylinder is the one over here on the left. Now, by looking at the car and everything, 93,000 miles does not look like it's ever been tuned up. Looks like everything is all original. So here would be your number one. All right. So the first thing we we'll do here is change all the eight spot plugs. Okay, because a misfire can come from a spot plug, which is inside this wire, or a bad coil. Okay, it could be either one of those. So I'm gonna go with a spot plug change all the way around. And what I usually like to do is I'm gonna take the coil and the wire from this setup, put it over here on number three, and number three setup, put it over here. All right, and then we're gonna go for a spin. We'll let the customer take it. If the misfire now becomes number three, then you know it's a coil or a wire, okay? I mean, if you wanna mess with it, you can either take the wire, put it on number five, and just switch the coil this way. So that way, if the misfire comes out on number five, then you know it's the coil wire, because that's the only thing that you change to number five. You follow me? So when it, without going for the expense of a $100 coil and maybe a $20 wire, $25 wire, we can take this wire that we suspect that might be bad and put it on five. Take the coil that we suspect might be bad and put it on three. All right, so if the misfire comes back and it's on three, then it's the coil. If the misfire comes on five, then you know it's the wire. But the spot plugs are all gonna be changed. All right, so what I'm gonna also show you is I'm gonna power break it, and I'm gonna see if I can get the exhaust noise for you. You can hear that it's misfiring. All right, so I got a little microphone hooked up to the back there. Let me put this out of the way. Let me set this up for you. And then I'll power break it and I'll tell you what we're going to do. All right, got my microphone hooked up in the back. All right, so to power break it, I'm going to step on the brakes really hard, okay, because you don't want the car moving. I'm going to put this bad boy in drive. Okay, I'm going to step on the gas just a little bit and you're gonna hear it misfire. If you look at the RPMs, you can probably see it flickering a little bit. Okay, you can also feel it in the steering wheel. Okay, so it's gonna go silent for a little bit. I'm gonna hook you up to the microphone back there by the exhaust and you're gonna hear it go boop, 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 okay, when I step on the gas. So I'm gonna hook up the mic.
Great. That's it. Don't want to hold it there too long, okay? You don't want to uh, burn up anything, torque converter or your brakes or anything like that. All right? Just for a little bit, and you can see that it's misfiring. It's bu -bu 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 -bu. All right, so that's what we're gonna do. Spot plugs. All right. Ciao. All Here's that number one spark plug we pulled out. All right, look at the spark plug. See that? Right up there, you can see like a line. It might be cracked. Either way, spark plugs are shot. All right, you can see that they're shot. Time for new ones. But yeah, look at that. Keeps going in. I hate these cameras that keep doing this. Because the focus is on something else. Let's go back here. See it? Nice little crack around that electrode there. Oh well. Alright. Time for plugs, people. Like I said, trying to troubleshoot a uh, misfire. Just want to take this wire. And transfer it with number five and then the coil I'm gonna move from one to number three all right that's what we're gonna do ciao yes it was a crack took a little tiny screwdriver and I just touched it and it fell apart all right that's it spot plugs <laughs> bye again